movies on Netflix. Hey everybody, Bird Gutter here. We are here with another one of the worst movies on Netflix. And this week, I was gonna say right off the bat, Please. I'm not exactly sure how long this review is gonna be because there Five is seconds. there is not much movie to review here. It's There's called no story. It's called Prison Girls. Prison right? Girls. And it's basically a '70s softcore porn. <laughs> You know, we thought there would have, this would have been like we thought this would be a Pam Greery, Ty Roger yeah, Corman, some kind of some some dialogue, some lines or whatever, of any sort. But it was mostly just like you like me, there you sure do, titties. But anyway, it starts off with these chicks in a prison scene, like in the first fucking minute, and then there's there's some very oddly shaped titties and full on seventies fucking monster bush. Wow, dude. I mean, it was like they had each one of them had just had this monster patch chilling, like a raccoon hanging oh, out yeah. down there. <laughs> But anyway, you know, they're in the shower, and then that just leads to a fucking shower fight, the fucking burly but female that was guard. Great, oh, though. yeah, because we saw fucking Pussy Lip. Well, we would have saw Pussy Lip if it wasn't all hidden by the fucking Can't massive you say fucking. It nicer? Why don't you just say you saw there. Pussy? You didn't have to say Pussy Lip. Pussy Lip makes it sound more <laughs> vulgar. I'm trying to be as vulgar as I fucking can on here. Haven't you noticed by now? But anyway, we couldn't see it anyway because it was covered up by the massive raccoons these bitches had between their fucking legs. Yeah, they were pretty big. I mean, it was kind of hard to see anything. It was like they all had, like, 70s wigs staped down there. Like those right? clown wigs you see that are all curly with the yeah. fucking rainbows. Except these didn't have rainbows. They were just big, brown, big, black, big, blonde, you know. Mm -hmm. but, you know, one the, one chick, man, she had, like, these gigantar titties, but they went all the way down to her belly button. It was yeah. weird. There was a lot of other <laughs> shaped titties in here. Yeah. 70s titties. Still titties nonetheless. Yeah, titties nonetheless. Can't really complain. So anyway, blah, blah, blah. These chicks go to talk to the psychiatrist, right? Oh, God. Dr. fucking Leatherface. Leatherface. Because she face. looks like the human equivalent like, of a cart in a fucking she cigarette. She looked like tanning mom's fucking grandma or something, you know what I mean? She was just yeah, like, she looked Whoa. awful. But anyway, she was all the girls, a human cigarette. all the girls went and talked to her, and they all gave her their fucking stories, and it was all had something to do with sex. Oh, I can't have an orgasm. Next girl, oh, I can't this. Oh, I have too much sex. Oh, I'm yeah, bored. but she was like, okay, girls, listen up. Here's what you gotta do. Go out to this one place, fuck all kinds of dudes, be right. You know, you're like, yeah. <laughs> so here's what the fucking psychiatrist did. She gave she up. She made this face all the time. <laughs> She gave up weekend passes to these girls. It Why just not? were in a big huge shower yeah. fight in the beginning. I mean, dudes don't we get that. fucking passes from weekend prison. For prison to go and do everybody. Yeah, because it know? was basically weekend prisons to fuck. Because the one chick got weekend to go. Weekend passes to fuck. Yeah, one chick got to go see, believe it or not, he's walking under. We'll get into the fake um, Kmart fucking William Cat in a minute. So there's a flashback while one of the girls is talking to the fucking human cigarette, right? And they're, they're talking about... Give me some advice, human cigarette! <laughs> the human cigarette tells her that back in the day, she went to this fucking party at a friend's apartment where it was basically just a fucking orgy. Man. And there was all kinds of fucking big titties and big bushes and rolling around and fucking lots of kissing and oh! Nope, now there's dick. Oh, yeah. oh, now there's balls. Yeah, well, yeah, unless you're gay. Hey, have at it. Hey, whatever. You know, you, no, whatever. Gay, you you like, dig that shit. But, you know, most people are normal adults, you know, grown-up adults, unlike you, that don't so, fucking run and hide when they just, see a penis. They're just like, oh, yeah. that's a penis. No, no, it's like, so for our straight fans, you've got titties in the, in the mega, mega bush, and for the gay guys, you have slight of balls and ass. <laughs> no, you got dick, too. But it, a lot of it was fucking see. hidden by the massive man bush. Too. I wasn't looking for the dick. Obviously, you well, saw them. It was there. It was on the fucking screen right in fucking front of I us. I must not have been looking at the time. But anyway, you I know what? I my eyes. It's fucking Roger Corman quality acting, and I really don't feel like talking about this, because it's like, okay, first chick goes to the apartment, has sex with her fucking husband, has an orgasm, whoop de fucking do She's like, Aah! First Next time. fucking... And then she wouldn't leave him alone. He's like, come on. We just said it like 70 times. 
Next chick goes to her fucking Kmart William Cat boyfriend that's a fucking pimp. And she, he has all kinds of girls. He fucking whoops that fucking, his, the bitch's ass. And then gets head. She gives yeah. a fucking head. She's and like, he's like, he's she's like, wham, 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 wham. I mean, beat like, her ass. Thank you for beating my ass. Hold on a second. I'll do you a favor now. <laughs> but he just goes, you know what to do. Blah. It's like, you just beat her ass. And she comes up and she's fucking doing it. Fucking nothing's wrong what? with her fucking face. That, well, because he has puss pillar hands, you know? I, I mean, guess. <laughs> But fucking, yeah, you know, I mean, I guess after you're done beating your woman, the moral of the story is, after you're done beating her, make her give you head. I guess. Yeah. Wow. Send all letters to Bird for 200 <laughs> But what fucking ever. I'm not ever. suggesting it. Then there was another girl, right? She went to this garage, something about her brother-in-law, and then this fucking biker gang comes up. Remember Hot Biscuits? Oh, Hot Biscuits. <laughs> this biker gang comes in, and they fucking basically force her brother brother-in-law to rape her. Oh, yeah. He used that. And, and uh, one dude kept saying hot biscuits. Everybody in that fucking room had the same physique. The only ones that were beefier were the women. You know, the women were all beefier and the dudes were all skinny as fuck. He was you like, oh, biker that's gang. your <laughs> sister-in-law? Well, you gonna fuck her anyway. And he was like, but I really don't want to. He's like, do it. He's like, you know what, fuck it. I always wanted to bang you anyway. <laughs> And after yeah. he was done, fucking grease monkey comb over was got up and was like, I really did! I raped someone! <laughs> like he was all proud Happy of it. about it. Yeah, yeah, it was like, you're a dick, dude. So what fucking ever, moving on to the next scene, there was this other girl. Number two! She oh, goes yeah. over to yeah. this fucking other girl's house. A cat fight turns into lesbian sex, turns into gunfire, turns into the shit dying. Best movie ever. No, it's not. <laughs> it's kind of awkward to sit there and watch this with your fucking friend. Yeah. Yeah. Because me, you, and Trish were down there fucking watching it. We're all just like, yeah, wow. You're, okay, the difference is your wife likes titties, just like we do. Yeah. You know, so yeah. But it was just like the scenes, like the rape scene, went on for a very uncomfortable Ever. amount Every of time. Every fucking scene did, because whenever they were kissing, they'd kiss for fucking ten minutes. Of, oh, yeah. <laughs> it was that loud, sloppy yeah. kissing. Yeah. But, you know, but the rape scene, you were just kind of like, okay, movie, we, we, <laughs> we get saw it. the rape. Like, we can move on, please. Thank you. You know, but it was like, no, no. They had to stretch that shit out for as long as they could. So whatever. The weekend oh. is over. The girl's passes expire. They go back to fucking prison. Except for the one girl that got shot in the gunfire. Oh, yeah. And then they all go back to see fucking the human cigarette. And, <laughs> and they're like, how is your sex, honey? And then. Good. And they were all fucking pissed off because the girl died. And then the one fucking girl gave this fucking big ass monologue about how they're really free and that the psychiatrist trapped behind her desk is the one that's really yeah. still in you prison. Know what that She's like, fuck you, bitch. So, yeah, that's that about so it. Gotten. So, basically, no plot, all kinds of yeah. weird fucking titties and massive fucking raccoon bushes and yeah, fucking <laughs> some <laughs> balls and some dick and some body some painting and. Balls and some dick, yeah, and then Bob Ross was in there painting some titties. Yeah, yeah that one chick, that blonde hair with with the fucking the blonde wig on, you with her massive tell. fucking. They were huge. Tits. She got up, she's like knocking the fucking everything down. Oh, because I forgot to mention this movie was in 3D when it was released. Yeah, so there was a lot of fucking intentional it wasn't 3D shots. On this though, so yeah. don't go grab your glasses, going, let's see fucking titties. Right here. But you can like, tell that it was like all kinds of intentional shots that were meant to be in yeah. 3D, like, like her titties, and titties like, getting up, and they move this way. It's like boom, 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 boom. They were huge. Yeah, yeah. But she was obviously wearing a wig, though. That was the one, man, where the fucking chick's titties looked all weird. Like oh, the yeah. one had like frog eye titties. Yeah, she had nipples like that, that were protruded out this way. Yeah, the, areolas that were fucking huge and weird puffy. looking. Yeah, huge. <laughs> Well, they fucking uh, were. They were. I, I didn't so know. anyway, the, on puffy nipples, uh, for puffy, bird gutter, puffy nipples. This has been another you got one some of big uh, buffalo pepper worlds, world, world, <laughs> world, world, <laughs> movies <laughs> on Netflix. <laughs> and we'll see you next week. If we're still with alive. what? I don't know. Yeah, it'll say at the fucking bottom. You should know by now. What if they're new? And they're like, we don't know, fatty. So won't you explain? No, then you just learned. We taught you. We learned you. We schooled you. How dare they remake that, you know? I mean, it's already well been done, but I mean, Yeah, that, I know, but it's like, it's still horrible. Nobody recognizes that one. Everybody yeah. refers back to Arnold Schwarzenegger's fucking... T just like they tried doing... You can't, dude, you can't repeat Arnold's movies. They tried doing Conan. Fail. 
Total Recall, fail. Every movie you try to redo of his, you can't, look, as bad as his movies might have been, some of them, still can't replace Arnold. Yeah. And that's the reason why we watched, you know? Yeah. Because we're going to see how many times he was like, get down, you know? <laughs> Run to the chopper. Oh, uh, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Sleep with the maid. Yeah, 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 yeah. So anyway, there's a flashback while one of the girl, while the psychiatrist is talking to one of the girls about like, oh, I do the voice about. Never mind. <laughs> what? <laughs> what you want me to do? Fucking cigarette? Nothing. Nothing. Never mind. <laughs> never mind.